In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to use the Buddy Boss mobile only theme. So to be clear, the purpose of the theme is to be run alongside another theme and you target one theme to desktop and this mobile only theme specifically to mobile devices. So here we are, I'm running 2015 and I'm on my profile and you can see if I go mobile, it's okay, but it's not great. So you might want to use our theme for the mobile layout. So here we are in the back end and we have the Buddy Boss mobile only theme. So let me activate it. And now when we go mobile, we have this really nice mobile layout. We can go here and see all our BuddyPress stuff and go here and see WordPress pages. So we've got a very app-like mobile experience. Now it's worth noting in WordPress, you can only run one theme at a time. So you can't have, uh, so, so you can only really customize this theme while it's active. So the first thing we do is activate the theme and then we can change some settings. So we can go to Appearance, Customize. And from here we can do some things like change the color scheme. Okay. So that's working. And we can also go to Widgets. And uh, there are a couple of widgets. There's a top widget area and a bottom widget area. And there's menus. You can assign the menus. Once you leave and once you disable this theme and activate 2015 or whatever your desktop theme is, you can no longer access that stuff. It's just part of the way WordPress works. So now the next question is, how do we target this to mobile and your desktop theme to desktop? And we're going to do this by adding a plugin. So I recommend searching for a plugin called Mobile Smart. There are a few plugins that do this, but this plugin is the one we recommend. It's free and it works nicely. Here it is, and I'm going to install it. Okay, so the Mobile Smart plugin is activated. So let's go to Settings, Mobile Smart. And from here, we can enable a mobile theme if we want, and we can select which theme we want to be the mobile theme. So we're going to select Buddy Boss Mobile only, of course, and click Update. And if you want, you can also set it to display on tablets. I would do that. And that's basically all you have to do. So there are some other settings they have here, but, well, for example, if I go into Manual, you can have a manual switch button at the bottom if you want, which will give people a button in their when they're on their phone. It'll give them a button to let them switch back to the desktop layout if you want. You might want to use that. Basically, once this, you've got this going, you would go to your Appearance Themes and activate 2015 as your main theme. And then the way to test this would be to open up a phone or a tablet and load your same website over there, and you should see our mobile theme loading there. Uh, that's the only way to test it. The way this plugin works, it's not based on screen size like a typical responsive type of thing. It's actually using device detection to determine what kind of device you have, and based on that, it's serving the other theme to you.